I know you're trying to add that new beast player to your squad. Don't open them packs. Head on over to muttreserve.com. Use code MTG at checkout. Get 15% off your order. Yo, yo, what up guys? Welcome back to another Madden 21 Ultimate Team video back with the No Money Spent Squad. And today we have monthly rewards. We did finish Legend. I got 61 wins in Weekend League. I didn't finish every week. So, I mean, I'm cool with that. I I'm cool with getting Legend. We get 2,400 training. Let's go ahead and quick sell that. Darren Waller is in packs and to pull him will be a huge W. Huge W. So, we get 15 gold player packs. 185 plus fantasy pack this pack is where i'm going to be looking to get waller at or anything good honestly anything that can help the squad this gold player pack though can get really glitchy but hey if you're watching this video right now i'm probably streaming so go ahead hit the link in the bio check out the stream come over there let's have some good vibes play some weekend league and chill out and i'm really hoping the bucks blow these boys out tonight man i'm, I'm excited bro i'm excited to see the bucks play thursday night football we got to get a w gotta get a w but let's get to these packs man 15 gold player pack right here. Come on, man. Give me some. I want to see some elites too. Some elites or some legend type status. Okay, we get 84 lane Johnson. Legend lights. Give me some legend lights. Legend lights order a little uh limited. Okay, that's not all right. This ain't looking good. This ain't looking good. This was terrible. Well, yeah, that was that was pretty bad. We only got one elite, bro. Just one elite. I mean, last year, bro, I swear I was getting like two, three elites sometimes, four elites, and I only got one, Lane Johnson. It's all good, though. It's all good, though. We still had an 85-plus fantasy pack. I'll just sell Lane Johnson, Um, see what I can do with the rest of those cards, put them to a set or something like that. But right here, man, I need something glitchy. Come on, 85-plus. Bruh. Got to open the pack again, bro. All right, here we go. Here we go. Okay, team of the week. Sean Alexander, 90 overall. Okay. Okay, actually, I haven't even... Let me check out this card real quick. He got 88 speed, 89 excel, 85 agility, 90 carrying, 69 catching, 86 change of direction, 87 trucking, 87 break tackle. It's all right. I mean, he could be a good backup on my squad, but hopefully he's not the best card we pull. I do not want him. <laughs> I don't want him. Next one. Okay, we get some big lights. Ah, 88, Richard Seymour, not bad. That's not bad, not too bad. Okay, next one, come on. Another team of the week, 87, Tyler Lockett. That's not the, what, what is this? Oh, okay, yo, I've never seen that animation. I've never seen, okay, that ain't bad though right there. That's a good card. That's a good card right there we can actually add to the lineup. 89 overall center. All right, come on, man, come on. And I'll leave. 86, Teron Armstead. All right, that's cool. So it's between the 89, the 89, honestly, could help my, help my team out right now. Because, yeah, I got, yeah, that's my center right there. And this is a good, good card, bro. Really good card. And then we have Sean Alexander, which, is, yeah, I just don't, nah. That's not the move. That's not the move. Actually, let's check the prices just in case I want to go ahead and sell it and get some coins. But I think I want to go with that center. Still a million coins. That's a glitchy card right there. But let's go check out these other players. Uh, Sean Alexander, that's who it was, right? So Sean Alexander is 119K, and Brandon Linder is 95K. I want to take this card, though, because, I mean, it's going to help my team right now. Oh, I see they got the weekly elite fantasy packs back up. <laughs> Yo, people was just buying these like crazy, bro. I just seen people had 20 of them, 50 of them. They were just buying them. They were just unlimited. It was a glitch. But you know what's crazy is they fixed that instantly. But dropping these interceptions, what's the deal with that? What's the patch that? That's what we need patch. Y'all fix that instantly, bro. Fix the stuff in the game just like y'all fix the stuff with these packs. Thank you. Okay. Anyways, anyways, man. Back to the packs, man. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and go with uh, the center because that's going to help my team right now. Sean Alexander would have been cool as a backup. That's about it. Or if he was my best pull, I would have sold him. But I'm going to go ahead and go with the center. And then I'll just sell the one I have right now. Brandon Linder, welcome to the squad. It would have been great to get Darren Waller, but we did get 89 overall center, so now my offensive line is actually pretty elite. I like the way it's looking right now. We got Darren Waller right here, powered him up to an 86 overall. All I did was I quick sold John o. Smith. 
and some other cards I had in my binders, low cards. And I was able to get them up to 86 overall. The next upgrade, though, I think I need like 12, 1200 trainer or something like that, which I, I can get that card right now. Well, to upgrade right now, and I think I will. And then I need like 1100 more. So, yeah. I know I'm not going to get the limited time because I don't open packs like that. And I mean, it's just going to be costly for a while. But with 2300 training, I can get them up to an 89 overall. And I mean, that's still a great card. And I think he still will be able to get tight end apprentice which is what I really, really want. Yeah, let's just power them up one more level. I can actually do both. Yep, let's do that. Let's do that. Ah, uh, so you can't get tight end apprentice until you actually get the full card. It's all good, it's all good. That's still a good card. And I think, how much? what is his speed right now? So he got 86 speed, 67 strength, 94 catching, catching traffic 87, spec catch 87, 93 short, medium 91, and 68 run block. That is not a bad card. I like it. Big target with some speed on him. So now I have Darren Waller, Dawson Knox. I like my tight ends right now. Speed and they tall. This is the rest of the offense right here. I like the way my offense is looking. I'm probably going to go ahead and get rid of Brandon Cooks. I like that DK Metcalf. That DK look good that's coming out tomorrow. So I think I want to go ahead and get DK added to the squad once I do my uh, solo challenges to get the free Nat player. Yeah, I mean, Brandon Cooks is he's cool, but he's short. DK is going to have 92 speed at 6'4 or 6'3, whatever his height is. And like I said, I think the taller receivers get better animations. I just think they glitchy. So that's what I want to go ahead and do. Uh, I'm probably going to just power him down today. Actually, no, because I'm going to keep him for weekend league. And then tomorrow, that's when I'll do all that. Because I'm going to need him for weekend league for his speed. Other than that, I'm cool with the offense. I'm thinking about actually getting rid of Bo Jackson too, man. Because I, I want to get a running back with backfield mismatch. I pass the ball a lot, so I feel like I need to get Reggie Bush on this team. Some way, somehow, I will have Reggie Bush on the squad. Defense side of the ball, I do like Derwin James, bro. I'm thinking about actually getting him. Um, maybe sell Isaiah Simmons and get Derwin James. I don't know. Isaiah, Sim It's just Isaiah Simmons, bro. He's 6'4 with the 90 speed. I mean, Derwin James is, what, 6'3? And I think he got 90 speed as well if you power him up. That's still not, that's not bad. Derwin is good, and Derwin got good man coverage and zone coverage. Isaiah Simmons don't. So I'm thinking about actually doing that. But the rest of the team is actually cool with me. I like it. I like my cornerbacks right now. Hopefully, I'm able to upgrade Dion fully soon. But like I said, man, I'm doing solo battles. We got weekend league, and I'm playing head-to-head -head as well. I'm just saving all those coins in my binder. And, uh, yeah, we're just going to quick sell them all at one time. And hopefully we're able to just go ahead and upgrade the team even more. But like I said, I will be streaming on Weekend League. If I'm not streaming now, I will be streaming today. But hey, let me know what you guys think. Should I add Derwin James, get rid of Isaiah Simmons, or Adrian Wilson? Well, nah, not Adrian Wilson. Adrian Wilson too good. But Isaiah Simmons, and then we try and get like Derwin James. Y'all let me know down below. Let me know. But hey, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you hit that like button down below. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. I'm out.